to me. Oh, hey Jess, change. Thanks for gifting Fevy. Learn from your mistakes. What? Why didn't you fly? Okay, well, that's one way to beat Jackson Lane. Get first blood. What the fuck? Why didn't he flash? Well, then again, if, if, he, if he just flashes, he's, he's still dead. I'll flash after him. But like, at least you could have burned my flash. Okay, well, that's how we beat Jax, boys. Get first blood for free. Now, bring it on, Tweet TV, Tony Top Wall. If I can't beat him with first blood, this matchup is impossible. My spirit is not lost. Okay, something to keep in mind. I do not have Conqueror. My goal is to prevent him from proccing Conqueror as much as possible. My hands are stained. Oh, it's gonna hurt. Unnecessary strike. Oof. Choose your own path. What? It's still fall. God damn it. He leveled up right then, got his W, and then killed me with it. Oh my god. And normal auto attack wouldn't have killed me either. Ah! He leveled up right as he flashed, learned his W, and killed me. Oh, that was actually pretty well played though. I can't be mad about that. Alright, so what I what I want to do now. Hey Ludwig. A new donation from Ludwig was just received for four dollars. Included message, take my goddamn money and fly away, bro. Oh. Alright, we are now what fourteen dollars into the flight? Hey Kellen. Fourteen dollars into the three hundred and seventy nine dollar flight fund. My spirit is not lost. Oh, my ward didn't catch that. My ward doesn't see the Karthus come in? Are you serious? I feel so debated right now. I put this ward here to, to catch Jax out on the rotation. To catch Jax out on the rotation and then also catch Karthus if he comes to gank. You're telling me this isn't enough to see when Karthus comes? I literally died only because of that. I'm salty, man. I cannot believe it. My lane's over now because of that. He's gonna get the snowball. Yeah, this is an inside job. I feel. I can't believe Karthus is like a thin and in a stick to be able to fit through that without get getting spotted by my ward. Look at that. Who's that thin? That's an unrealistic body standard.
Alright, it's sad, but I think the lane is over now. Without without a good Hecarim gank, there's, for the most part, no way to win this. As long as the Jax doesn't make a huge fuck up. He has this in the bag now. My hands are stained. What conflict awaits? Have you ever tried going Emax and sustain against Jax? I've tried. He he just out damages you. You can you can not die to him, but you can't stop him from pushing. Unfortunately, against high sustain damage champions like Jax, you have to go for the burst. How should I proceed? Okay. I, I still had barriers, so like, I, don't, I don't know why he fought that. As I said earlier, unless he makes a huge fuck up like that, fighting without his E, he wins the lane. But I'm glad I'm glad he made that mistake. I'm really surprised he did, because like I had barrier as a backup. But I will happily take it. I needed that. I gotta remember the Karthus ult. That's the one who beat me up, Mom! Damn. I used my barrier to get an extra proc of shield bash. But it wasn't enough damage. That's kind of risky. I should've just saved it for the card assault. is not lost. Oh, you don't want to try? Choose your own path. Oh, okay. Looks like I didn't need to flash. Damn it. Wasted flesh. Ah! 
violence to end violence. Wait, is time to Annie the same person as Annie Bot? Oh, I wasted some time. I really should have stayed to get the plate. Because I literally just like walk up here and I recall. And then the minions get the plate as I finish. Yeah! Money! How should I proceed? I love that move. Any of won't be playing for a while. Is he alright? I, I heard what happened in the Twitch Rival stuff. Has he said anything since then? A sword mirrors its owner. Oh my god, you killed him. You killed him, you animal! You killed him in midair! If I get one turret plate here, can I afford my cleaver? How should I proceed? Okay, I can't believe we're actually making a comeback in this lane. Oh. Hey! Yeah, we died twice. I was like, okay, this, this lane is over. But then, unsealed spellbook, we got the cheese. I feel like that's the only way to beat Jax. It's the only way I've ever beaten a good Jax recently. It's just like, they make a, not an obvious mistake, but so, something that's like kind of obvious in hindsight. Like, that Jax, when I killed him, he was probably just like, oh, I didn't realize that Riven had that much damage. He's like, I thought I could survive until my E came up. Feels like that's the only way to win. Just like, he makes a mistake and I capitalize on it. Which is unfortunate. I'd much rather be able to win by being like, okay, if I play clean and like, I don't know, sidestep the E, I win. But it's not really like that. It's definitely like, it's like definitely his lane to lose. He has to make the mistake for me to win. Isn't that every lane? Nope. Ribbon versus Irelia. If Ribbon, if I play smooth and clean and don't make, don't make simple mistakes, I guess it's almost like the opposite. Choose your own path. Oh. Okay, I'm not gonna bother. In the Ribbon vs. Irelia lane, it's Ribbon's lane to lose. As long as you don't make the mistake, you win the game. But also, there are a lot of outplay avenues for both both champions. For Riven vs. Jax, it's definitely like, every outplay is mostly just like, Jax making a mistake, rather than the Riven actually doing something. What about Riven vs. Fiora? Riven vs. Fiora is awesome. There's so much outplay potential on both sides. It never feels like it's one person's lane to lose. I love that matchup a lot. Um, let's get Death Dance. Okay, my team is awesome this game. Mid and bot won really hard, and I made my comeback. How do you feel about the punishment Jared's team got for him oversleeping? I mean, I think it's... It sucks, but it's like... It's fair. I don't think there was any specific rules set beforehand. I think what they, um, whatever the admins did was like, was reasonable. Like, cause yeah, like it's true. Like if you're late, you're keeping, you're keeping the broadcast waiting and 10 other people or nine other people waiting. So I, I think what he did was like bad, but like, 
I also feel sorry for him. I think people are being way too mean on him. Learn from this. What was his punishment? Uh, they 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 lose one game for free. Cause like I'm pretty sure they what is that not in the bush? Really? That's not, bro. My hands bro, that's really not in the bush. Hmm. Damn, that was, that was well played. He w waited out my exhaust. It is? It- Wouldn't it be like shadowed if it were? Oh, I'll trust you guys. God, what do you do? She like insta-cleanse that. Versus Camille. Oh, am I dead? Alright, this is where you really, really cock block him. You see this? You see my HP bar? What conflict awaits? Wait for it. Okay, now I start recalling. As soon as Card the spawns, he's gonna ult. I'm gonna heal a little bit in the fountain, and then I'm gonna survive. Oh, he didn't go for it. He didn't go for it! Man. Whatever. I didn't want to show off in front of the ladies or anything. Oh, now you go- Oh, I gotta go back top. Okay, so what about Ribbon vs. Camille? I- uh, That matchup feels hard. Most people don't play Camille top anymore, but back when they did, I felt like the matchup was one of the Ribbon's worst ones. It felt like you could farm, but you could never kill her. I, sorry, I shouldn't say worst. It, it felt like a moderately difficult one. There, Pantheon or Renekton is definitely more oppressive. It feels very hard to kill her because they're at E. Very hard to gank as well. So I, I really hated that matchup because you just like sit there and farm. And then Camille wins small trades, and if you ever have an actual lead on her, like a gank, she just E's away. There are ways to outplay the E, of course. You can stun her as it's coming out. I'm about to get ganked by Karthus, but I kind of, I'm, I'm feeling a little greedy right now. Oh, what did I walk into? Okay, at least he got the Cassiopeia. Oh no, he missed. I oh, got him anyway. Oh my god, I flashed into a bush. It was an ambush! Wait. Yeah! This isn't your ordinary average bush. This is an ambush. I can't believe it! <laughs> uh, don't wanna just TP? Nah, not yet. Oh, What's wow. up? Thank you so much. What conflict do we Chase? Okay. Oh! Oh shit! No, 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 no! Saved! Saved!
That's one way to dodge a Carthasol. Actually, it's not just one way. That was... That was the best way. You, how can